praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Good day wherever you are. God will bless you in Jesus' name. I just want to quickly share your thoughts from the scripture with you today. Uh, in the book of Job chapter 36, Job 36 verse 5, the Bible says that God is mighty and despiseth not any. God is mighty. He does not despise anyone. That is in the King James. In Amplified, says God is mighty and yet despises no one nor regards anything as trivial. The meaning of that is that God does not take anything as a joke. Whatever decision you make, whatever thing you say before the Lord, the Bible even says, don't say before an angel that it was a slip of the tongue so that God will not be angry with you and destroy the works of your hand. So nobody can come to God that God will despise. Whether you're big or small, whether you're young or old, when you come to God, He accepts everyone. That is what Jesus confirms in John chapter 6, verse 37. He says, nobody comes to him that he will cast away. He says, if any woman comes to him, he will not cast him or her away, no matter his situation, no matter how bad you may be. Mm -hmm. uh, the great woman of God, of blessed memory, Kore Ten, Kori Ten Boom, she said, says in her words that no matter how deep the pit you may be in, God is, Jesus is deeper still. No matter your condition, no matter how bad, no matter how degenerated and degenerating your situation may be, when you come to Jesus, he will not despise you. He will not reject you. He will not cast you away. He accepts everyone that comes. He doesn't know joke. The reason God does not joke is because everything he says is the truth. And once he says it, even if it was not so before, once he has said it, it will become so. So he despises no one. He despises no one. That is what I want you to know today, wherever you are hearing me. No matter your condition, no matter your situation, God will not cast you away. He will not despise you and he will continue to bless you. In the name of Jesus, I pray that the mercy of God will rest on you. The hand of God will come mightily upon you and your situation will be better than ever in the name of Jesus. Receive mercy. Receive grace today and the grace of God will abide with you in the name of Jesus. I remain your friend, Stephen Orioye Olakunle. And if you have not subscribed to this channel, make sure you do. Press the notification button so anytime we drop another video, you can benefit as you hear the word that God is sending, sending to you again and again in Jesus' name. God bless you. Shalom.